There we are, guys. Hopefully, the sound is okay as well. We had some issues last time. My casual crew, how is everybody today? I'm doing well. I'm doing really well. Let's just hear the sound. Hopefully, it's not bad. The sound sounds good, and I'm here keeping it casual with my crew. Let's go, Adam King. Very special hello to you, my friend. We'll get into that in a minute. But how is everyone? Doing all right? Great to hear, guys. So, we've got 12 people in the live stream, 14, 15 likes already. Amazing. Today, we're going to open some, uh, some blisters, some dual monsters blisters, so you get some cards in here as well. I don't think anyone has ever pulled anything good out of here, but let's go. Mikey, King Mikey, uh, there's something on my head. There is something on my head. There is a little cap. I'm thinking about diversifying the channel, guys. This is the, I'm joking, not the casual hat, but maybe one day. <laughs> just uh, just chilling, guys, and uh, thought I'd go live. I haven't uploaded many videos this week, so apologies for that, um, but I'm gonna hopefully make up for it today. We're gonna be announcing the 4,500 subscriber special, which is exclusive members only. We'll get into it in a minute. Got some PSA cards here that I'm looking to sell, so we'll go through those in a minute as well. Got some mail from, uh, where is this? From Thailand? From Dr. Chickens in Thailand? So that's pretty cool. Blue EX has joined. So has Setsu. Says, I pulled some fire from Legacy Blisters. Hopefully you will too. I hope so. I've never really pulled anything better than a Secret Rare Trihorn Dragon. Um, I'd love to get like a, a B-Skull reprint or um, Jinzo. Uh, we've got some Dark Crisis. We've got two Dark Crisis, four Pharaoh Servant, one Spell Ruler, and two Metal Raiders, which we'll be opening today. That's the opening side of things. Uh, but Blue loves the hat, so thank you, Blue. Just try to be different. Why not? In fact, I'm liking this uh, hat, so we'll go green in the background because of the hat. Is that green? Man, that does not look green on camera. That's really weird. Should we go red? Yeah, let's just go red. But yeah. Noah says, good luck. Guys, let's crack open a Dark Crisis for those early access viewers, for the 21 people who are here. So we'll go for a Dark Crisis first. Then I'll get into the piece of mail which Dr. Chickens has sent us. Hopefully that's exciting. I don't know what it is. I think he sent us something just to open and, and just as a collaboration. So he's really kind. So let's see what we get out of these. These are really hard to find here in the UK. We don't have blisters, unfortunately. We actually don't even have Yu-Gi-Oh! in stores here in the UK. It's really, really tragic. We don't have Target, no Walmart, none of that. Fun stuff. Ooh, here we go. So a Dark Horizon secret rare. I wasn't expecting that. That's pretty good. And a Kaiser Vorse Raider. Decent, man. I was not expecting secret rares out here. Pulse Mines. Uh, these are coming with the Duelist stuff. Uh, chosen by the world. Jane likes uh, Twilight Swan General. That's pretty cool. So that's decent. Bring out your own clothes with Kaiju Yugi stuff on it. Imagine that. That would be cool. That's... that's <laughs> I think that'll probably be for the 10,000 subscriber special, guys. Definitely uh, no, not soon. Maybe you guys would like a hat, but... Archfiend's Roar. Keldo. Shinato's Ark. Oh my gosh! Mudora! So we start off with a Mudora. In fact, Adam was giving this away as, secret, as a um, PSA graded card, I think, for one of our videos. Mephis the Infernal General. Battle Scarred. And Satsuke Samurai number two. These were brought to me by Noah. So Noah... A casual Yugi stuff subscriber he subscribes to our channel he bought these blisters for me and sent them to me essentially because I can't get them in the US so massive shout out to Noah thank you very much my friend I hope you're here watching with us if you are let me know so we've got Moodora so far Ego Chip says hello hello Ego Chip uh, Black Dragon says Jamie put that Exodian Necros or just remove this yes I'd love to pull the Exodian Necros that's a very good card definitely want to pull the Exodian Necros even in unlimited it's still worth quite a bit so yeah, and let's open um, Dr. Chickens' mail. This is really heavy, so I don't know what he sent us, actually. So, we'll have to find out. Dr. Chickens, check out his channel. I'll link his channel down below. Something to think about, maybe. I'm sure I'd love a hat with your logo on it. Yeah, def definitely, Mikey, for sure. Hello, Emanuele. Oh, my God. What have we been sent by Dr. Chickens? Oh, my God. Guys, this is insane. Oh my, so many booster packs. <gasps> this opening just got even bigger. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Guys, this is insane. Did I miss anything, Warrior of Zero? Not yet. Oh my god, what has Dr. Chicken sent us? Has he sent us every single pack up to 5Ds? Oh my god, I think he has. 
Guys, he sent us every single Yu-Gi-Oh pack up till 5Ds. Is this serious? No way. I think he has. Or at least so many packs. Dr. Chickens. Oh my gosh, guys. He sent us a load of packs. GX. Oh my god. Guys, we're going to open all these today. I don't even care. And he sent us some Pokemon cards and Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So let's see what's inside. Let's see what's inside of here. Koreans. Yes, more Ultimate Rares. That's a very good point. Yeah, Ultimate Rares. We need to add to the counter, which is just here. It's really awkward because it's reversed, but... Um, Black Dragon says either Dark Flare Knight or Scarlet Fiend of Lightning. Master of Zork also. Um, let's have a little look here. Okie dokie. So we've got an Aqua Aqualian Alessa. Neospatian... Sorry, uh, Gran, uh, Gran Neos. Elemental Hero Granios and Elemental Hero... Oh, this is from my box break that I that I bought a special edition of him. So that's pretty cool. And that's the Phantom of Chaos. And I pulled a different Dimension Dragon from the Dark Crisis pack from him. Oh, he's also thrown in something else, which is a Transcendent Wings and some Pokemon stuff, which I'm not very familiar with. I know that's a Globat or something. Um, don't know any of these newer Pokemons, guys. <laughs> it's casual Yugi stuff, not casual Pokey stuff after all. Um... What's up, Jamie? So sorry I'm late, Sweetsman. No worries, man. No problem at all. I'm glad that you're here. Um, but yeah, Dr. Chickens has sent us a ton of Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds packs. Should we open them in order? Should we open them in order? I think I feel like we should open these in order. Um, that's going to be pretty epic. I'm going to actually save these for another video, though. Opening every Korean pack. Should I save them? Guys, let me know. Do you want me, do you want me to open these now? Or should we... You probably want me to open them now, don't you? I don't want to be a killjoy and <laughs> open these later. But let me know if you want me to save them for whatever reason. But it's got to be a valid reason. I'm just putting them in order. Raging Battle is the fourth pack in 5Ds. I'm just glad everything made it safe, says Noah. Thank you, Noah. I'm very glad too. I appreciate you, man. So yeah, there we go. That's the order of all the packs. Right from Soul of the Duelist. Straight through the early eras of GX. Sorry. All these GX booster packs. Look at that. Just open them, mate, says Adam. Adam! Everybody watching. Adam, it is your birthday, Adam, today. I was unaware of this, but you've told me before the live stream. So if it's anyone's birthday and you're a casual Yugi stuff subscriber, you know you're going to get a gift. And what I'll be gifting Adam, as he is a long-time subscriber of the channel, I'll be giving him a booster pack. I'm giving this Cyberdark Impact from my personal collection for free to Adam for his birthday. So everybody say happy birthday to Adam down in the chat today. Um, save it. I'm not ready to give my full attention because of work. So said to, you can come back and watch it. I think everyone wants me to open it now. Asking um, us if he should open. Duh. <laughs> yeah. Save it for a video. People say save for an epic video. But they can have ghosts, says Matthew. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe save it. Open my, everyone's saying save them. That's interesting. Nice hat indeed, Velus. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. But this is Adam, so uh, let's do it. Matthew says, my birthday is 29th of June. Well, whatever I'm feeling like, I will give you, my friend, on, on your birthday. Just let me know if it's your birthday. <laughs> but don't abuse it, because birthdays are but once a year. Instant Fusion. Man Beast of Aries. Accumulated Fortune. Fire Statue of the Inferno. And just a miraculous rebirth, unfortunately, for Adam's birthday. Man, I would have loved him to get an ultimate round on his birthday. But happy birthday, Adam. You're more than welcome, my friend. You're more than welcome. You're a long-time subscriber of the channel. I've got to give something back to my boys on their birthday. Boys and girls. Okay. All right, guys. So, I'm going to continue with the blisters, because that's what you're here to see. You're here to see the vintage kind of... It's not really vintage, is it? It's, uh, it's just... Um, Legacy packs, but let's see if we can get something good out of here. All right, Metal Raiders. Instant Fusion is a nice first card, says you go shit. Indeed. Ooh. Okay, so here's another blister. We've got, a, wow, another secret rare. So Gimmick Puppet Deary Doll. Man, you can get some good cards out of here. That's from PGLD. Spiritual Beast Tamer Winder. Flower Oh my gosh, I've literally, I'm literally watching the Yu-Gi-Oh! Arc 5 episode where this comes in, where the duelist in the facility is, is playing that. So that's really strange that I've actually got the card now. Interesting. Pretty good, pretty good holo foil so far, guys. I'm going to keep out all the good stuff to the side. 
Okay, so those are the pools that we've got so far from these uh, blisters, which is pretty good. But Metal Raiders, let's see Metal Raiders. Let's get a uh, Summon Skull, B Skull, Gate Guardian. Actually, I have pulled a Gate Guardian. I have pulled a Gate Guardian before, but would love to do it again. Saggy the Dark Clown. <laughs> Polished Eagle, Baby Dragon, and the Bistro Butcher. Just Millennium Radiant, Pumpkin, Bakuri Box, Tongyo, Illusionist Spaces Mage, but Baby Dragon, definitely favorite of mine from Metal Raiders, as well as Saggy the Dark Clown to be fair, but okay, that's the um, second pack down, should we go for a PSV, let's go for a PSV guys, Pharaoh Servant, let's, uh, just keeping it casual, my birthday was two months ago and seven days ago, Black Dragon, you gotta let me know it's your birthday guys, <laughs> and I'll, I'll open something for you on the channel, Matthew says very kind gesture, not a problem at all, Ooh, what is that I see, is that a Wabaku? Nice, look at that. Shatterfoil. Pretty cool. Mech Knight of the Moon Morning Star. Is that with a gold name? I think it's gold name. And copycat. Let's go. Pretty cool, man. I'm, I'm enjoying these uh these random inserts. Casual Yugisad is a <laughs> casual Yugisad is a bad man. <laughs> Hopefully that's in the good good meaning of bad man. Ooh, DDD Super Doom King Purple Armageddon. I haven't seen this being summoned yet, but it looks pretty scary. Actually, maybe I have. Don't know, DDD Flame High. Yeah, this is some Arc 5 stuff. You know Arc 5 is pretty good. I'm watching it at the moment. Mine's next month, it's Warrior of Zero. Perfect, mine is also next month, guys. July is my birthday. So, that'll be pretty cool. Uh, MRD, people want me to have MRD. Let's get Jinzo, come on. We've gotta get Jinzo, guys. Metal Detector, Invitation to a Dark Sleep. Well, Suppression. Beast the Tower, maybe? Ah, Girochin Cooker Tower. And Light Force Sword, classic Yugi card. Here's Obelisk in Seto Kaiba's hand. Pretty cool. What did I miss? Says Abdul Aziz to Mimi. Not much so far. Um, PSV, hmm, let's get the Jinzo slash Thousand Eyes, indeed. Let's go for another PSV. Let's go for a uh, back to back Pharaoh Servant. In fact, I've got to spin that round. Let's see if we can get something good. Now we are the badass. Okay. July Gang, yes. Mine was last month, fire. Ooh, here we go. Vorticular Drug Drumgon. Oh, that's a weird card. Ooh, Raid Raptor, Final Fortress Falcon. Man, I don't know if these cards are worth anything, but they're definitely pretty cool. There's a first edition Shadow Spectre, Soul Drain Dragon, that's pretty cool. Vampire Grace, this is a Shadow Spectre first edition cards there. That's really weird. And Judgment of the Light, first edition, Super Defense Robot Leo. Interesting, interesting. So here is our PSV. Can we get something out of PSV, guys? I hope so. Come on, Jinzo, man. Oni Tank T34. We're wanting vermin. Here we go, guys. I think we've got something. Do we have Jinzo? It's another Gear Freed, the Iron Knight. I pulled this just the other day. That is insane. This card loves me. Gear free, the Iron Knight with Magic Drain. This card reminds me of when Solemn Yu-Gi-Oh pulled Magic Drain with Ruxin's opening and he <laughs> he photoshopped his face. It was hilarious. You had to see it. Island Turtle, Spikebot. Very nostalgic card for me. Spikebot for some reason. I just see it and I remind, it reminds me of my childhood. But we've got a Gear free, the Iron Knight. I'll be opening a 380 euro order. Wow. Fuck you, that's incredible. 52 people in the stream guys welcome 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 so what we what we'll be doing for the four and a half k special as well i'm going to be cracking open because there's 52 of you i want to show you we'll be cracking open this tomb chaos first edition for my casual crew um people have been buying these my casual members of course and james bowman has just subscribed i feel like james bowman has subscribed before but welcome back <laughs> and then we'll also be cracking open because our 4,000 subscriber special was so good, we pulled so well, I've now offered another LOB um, first edition Spanish Producto Oficial en Español. This is a Spanish box that we'll be opening. The box is open, completely untampered, guaranteed unscaled. This is from Mr. Joey Wheeler, who has provided us this to open on the channel for the 4,500 subscriber special. So far, so good. Gear Freed and Mudora. Let's keep going. Let's go for, a, uh, let's go for another PSV. Three PSV in a row. Why not? Why the hell not, guys? Hello, Cliff Coilus, Mr. Subscribe. Thank you so much, Cliff. I appreciate your subscription. 
So, here we go. So, the Tribe Shocking Virus, that's the Photon Shockwave card. They, this is so weird. I wonder where they come from, you guys. The Eye of Demias! That's a really good card. I didn't own it. Performage, still a slancer. Googly Eyes Drum Dragon. Oh, what? Giant Soldier of Stone in Spanish. Baraja Inicio Yugi. This is a this is an unlimited giant soldier of stone from the Spanish starter deck. Oh my god, that is weird. Performer pal, Fire Flux. Uh, there we go. Cambio de Fidelidad. So that's another Yugi starter deck Spanish card. That is weird. But we got the Eye of Tamias. That's pretty cool. Jamie, but how about a, a birthday 4.5 sub special? My birthday's next month, guys. It's just over a month away. So I'll be doing a birthday special. I'm going to open some of my own product, guys. Some pretty cool stuff for my birthday. Um, you selling those LOB packs, Izzy? Yes. However, I've only listed these in my... Uh, Hello, Mystics, with the kind donation. Thank you so much. You always donated 999, man. I feel like it's your favorite number. So thank you so much, Mystic Collections. The delay is going to come in like five, four, three, two, one. There it is, Mr. Collection. Thank you, my friend. Uh, sorry about the delay. I'm going to sort that out. I really do. My computer is just too slow. What was I saying? Yes, for the LOB Spanish box, guys, we'll be opening it live this weekend, as well as that Toon Chaos First Edition. There's five packs left. I want to give my casual crew to people who are in the actual um, um, private group chat the chance to buy them. They already have. But if we don't sell out by the end of tonight, I will be posting it to Instagram. So, you know, you, you guys will be able to purchase it. So, Bubonic Vermin, Respect Play. Oh my God, we've got a fusion. Only tanky 34,000 eyes restrict. Let's go. Huge pull. I just watched Simply Unlucky open this and his reaction was so good. And we just got it. Oh, baby. Nice. Thousand Eyes Restrict. Huge, huge pull. That is great. And another Light Force Sword. Nice. Noah's Packs bringing us the luck with Thousand Eyes Restrict. <laughs> That's epic. That is so good. I wish it was a Jinzo, but this is like the next best thing. Of course, you got Buster Blader, but man, that is epic. Let's go. Boom. I will take it. Setsu is impressed. Fire says, nice. Let's go, Noah. You absolute star. <laughs> Sickest Mo says, oof. <laughs> Jinzo Secret Rare will be next. That's great. So that's, oh, we're doing really well. I think we pulled four, four, three foils so far out of four packs. I can't complain. These legacy packs are great. So much fun to open. Um, let's keep it going, guys. Let's keep up the heat. Should we go for Spell Ruler? Yeah, nobody likes. Well... That's a bit harsh. Spell Ruler was my first ever set, so... I do like it. Dr. Chickens, my friend! You are here, and I want to say thank you to yourself for providing us with all these epic packs. I might save them for another video, but I might open them now. Because people want me to open it now, but then again, a lot of people want me to keep it saved, so... Let's see what we can get out of uh, Spell Ruler. So we've got another foil-looking card here. Pegasus Boy, what's your favourite... What pack is my favorite Setsu? I don't know. I couldn't tell you what my favorite pack was. Probably the pack that I opened most when I was a kid was Ladder Destruction or Tactical Evolution. Um, man, I opened so many packs. <laughs> my parents hated me for it. <laughs> Basically, spent thousands on it, and that's why I'm still here today doing it. <laughs> because I love the Yu-Gi-Oh! Shall never die. Um, okay, so let's see if we can get something out of Spell Ruler. Not my favorite, but it's my first ever pack that I opened when I was good. So, Gravekeeper Servant, Magical Labyrinth, Fairy's Hand Mirror, just a giant rat, unfortunately. Peacock, Eternal Rest. I feel like this card increased in value recently. Chorus of Sanctuary and Final Destiny. That is someone with their hands on his head, isn't it? In Final Destiny? Yeah, that's not a tree. That's someone holding their hands on his head. Cool field spells from back in the day, but just a giant rat. Um, let's keep going. Shall we have some fun to the video? I do have some blister packs I'd like to open, potentially. Other than, other than these, of course, but... Let's go, uh, let's go Metal Raiders, guys. Let's go Metal Raiders. Happy birthday to Adam. Yeah, I will open those now, as Dr. Chickens is here. 
Thank you, my broski. It's all good. The fans know you best whenever they please. So definitely check out Dr. Chicken's guys. He's so generous. He sent us so many cool uh, packs to open, which is just amazing. Don't think there's anything else here. Link streamer. <laughs> Link streamer. Casual streamer. We are basically the same thing. Come on, Metal Raiders. Give us something good. I remember packing a, gin a Jinzo? Uh, metal Raiders uh, Magicians. <laughs> what am I trying to say? I remember pa pulling a Mirror Force on Christmas Day. Um, back in, I think it was like 2000, it might have been 2004 that I pulled the Metal Raiders um, Mirror Force on Christmas Day. That was like one of my best ever pulls when I was a kid. I was so happy because it was such, it was a card everyone wanted, Mirror Force. The Bistro Butcher. Freaky looking card. Music Musician King. Solis. Destroyer Golem. Just a uh, rare. Prevent Rat. Very nostalgic. Mystic Lamp. And Gazelle, the King of Mythical Beasts. Purple Power Ranger is the best. James says yes. Beast Skull, Gate Guardian Inbound. Love it. I wish. Guys, that wasn't very good. But we'll crack open some of these. Um, some of these now, I think. I don't have scissors, so I'm going to have to just do these by hand. But let's see if we can get some ultimate rares and add to our, uh, add to our counter. Because we're on 277. The counter needs to hit 280 by the end of tonight. So do we have anything? Nope. We would have loved to have got a Horus out of that. So Rise of Destiny. Should we go for the creator? Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of Rise of Destiny, I'm giving away a card today, guys. I'm giving away Perfect Machine King. I found him. This is a uh, triple sleeved, I think pack fresh, Perfect Machine King. I was gifted it by, I think, a friend at uh, Locals. It's my friend Danny, and he said, give it away uh, for your next giveaway. So Perfect Machine King, guys, is the giveaway for today's video. Apologies for announcing it midstream, but... Sometimes things you forget things and you can't edit this video. So yeah, I'm giving away the perfect machine king. Let me just take this hat off because it's so hot. Um, yeah, so perfect machine king, guys. Drop a like, comment what was your favorite pull, and just you know subscribe. You know what to do, guys. So we'll crack open this uh, Rise of Destiny. Nick Francis says, "Have you done something to the brightness, dude? Looks really overexposed. We can edit that. If it is overexposed, we can edit it, my friend. Do not worry." Let's just go to filters and edit that exposure. Is that a bit better? Hopefully that's a bit better for you. Sorry about that. Firefox. We got something. No, we do not. It sucks. James Bauman says, great card. I don't have that one yet. Perfect machine game. Yes, it's a good card. Perfect machine game. From who uses perfect machine care? I think that's like one of the big five, right? Okay, guys, flaming eternity. Let's just crack this open. Haircut looks fresh. Thank you. Izzy. I I always do my my own haircuts, guys. People are like casual. You're looking so fresh, but I cut my own hair, guys. Every little helps when you're saving up money to buy Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So take my advice. Cut your own hair. Ooh, hello. So we've got a uh, Phoenix Wing Blast. Oh, I would have loved to have got a Behemoth King of All Animals. My favorite, one of my favorite cards. I think one of my favorite all time early Yu Gi Oh! GX sets. Um, Behemoth, the King of All Animals. Such a good card. Um, but yeah, let's see if we can get an ancient gig on them out of this. Dr. Chickens, the legend, sending us some incredible booster packs. We pulled an ulti last time he sent us some packs. It's like getting a little care package. But Elemental Hero Avion. Seeing some of these packs in Korean is so weird, says uh, Matthew. Why is that so weird? I actually have more Korean um, boxes, but they're the Dual Monsters eras. So we'll be opening those in a separate video. So just a little uh, Jerry Beans man. Man, we would have loved a Cyber Dragon ulti or a Cyber. Cut own hair. <laughs> Dr. Chickens. Yes, indeed, my friend. I cut my own hair. Um, let's see if we can edit that exposure. It still seems to be a little bit bright. Yeah, maybe that's better. Is that better? Yeah. Okay. Alright dudes. Alright casuals. Elemental energy. Let's get an ulti uh, e-hero. Okay. Let's do it. Morning H2O. Oh my god. We've got a fusion. VW Tiger Catapult. Man. Man. Come on. A couple of ultis would be nice. Let's get a uh, sacred beast ulti. 
The stuff like APT and RDS, I think, don't get reprinted loads. So our rare records, Matthew. Interesting. I'm very lucky to be opening these. Thank you, Dr. Chickens. Mm, haven't even got a foil yet. Come on. Believe in the heart of the cards. We're still on the Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, GX side of things. So let's get something out of EOJ. This definitely looks different. Like, I've never seen an EOJ. Um, Korean. Is this Korean? Yeah, this is Korean. I'm not a Korean specialist guy, so I don't really know. How, how come there's a 5Ds thing in a, in, a, in a... This is a missing child, isn't it? Yeah. I remember this thing. E-emergency call. Just a forced back. Uh, Necro Shaman. I just pulled a Black Rose Dragon yesterday, James. Was that the Starlight Black Rose Dragon from the new set? Lightning Overdrive. If so, that is, that is incredible. Congratulations. Um, just cracking open these. Let's see if we can get an ulti. So we've got a Destiny Hero Defender. Neos! Lovely pull. Love Neos. Put him down with our, um, that's our best pull so far. We've still got the, uh, still got these packs for Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, GX. So let's see if we can get something. James Bowman says, yes, I just pulled, oh, it was, it was a, um, brilliant stuff. That's Starlight Black Rose. Congratulations. That's a huge pull. Cyber Ogre. Man, this is tough. Lethal Protector says, have you any cards that you're waiting for at PSA? Yeah, absolutely. I, I've got, I think, two more submissions still at PSA. Both with over 100 cards in. They're both box submissions and I can't wait to get those back. But will it be at least another couple of months? At least, because they're so slow. Oh, there it is! Great Shogun Shen! Ultimate rare! Let's go! Casual crew! Boom! Nice! That is nice! That is a sick looking ultimate rare! Let's go! Nice! Dr. Chickens providing us with the Strike of Neos Fire. I remember we also got a uh, ultimate rare last time from Strike of Neos. So, 278. Let's go! Ulti counter plus one. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Nice guys, great Shogun Shem, such a cool card. Yeah, it's a bit, it's a little bit too dark now. I think the um, the actual colours itself in this video, I think they're a bit too dark. There you go. I think that looks better. But yes, high five everybody. Nice, 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 nice. We'll go red. In the background, we'll sleeve up our great Shogun Shen. Definitely a highlight of the video. And Thousand Eyes Restrict. Both very good pulls so far. Our pulls are just below us. All right, guys. This is good. So we did get a naughty. Thanks to Dr. Chickens. Let's go for Force of the Breaker. Which is, again, I think one of those Korean packs which is rarer. Because I haven't seen anyone open these. Okay. Does that count towards an ulti counter? Absolutely. That is an ultimate rare, my friend. That If that doesn't count, I don't know what counts. And another 5Ds. Ooh, this one looks cool. Look at this. This looks really cool. Got Stardust Dragon and Yusei on that. That's pretty cool. I'm going to put that in my binder. In my 5Ds um, binder. Nice. I love these little insert cards. They look so cool. Obviously, there's a missing child on the back, which isn't cool, but... It's cool that they've got you say on it, definitely. Uh, never mind, I'm slow, says Warrior of Zero. Uh, James says dope. Uh, let's go Tactical Evolution. Can you get a Ghost Rare from here? I think so. Let's see if we can get a Ghost Rare Rainbow Dragon. This was a really expensive pack. Surely another to go. This was a really expensive pack. Thanks, Dr. Chickens. Honestly, I'm very, very appreciative of what you're doing for me. Hey, Desert Twister. So we've got a, got a Super Rare. Nice. Decent. That's an ultra rare in the actual um, TCG. Terrible ultra rare. Gladiator's Assault. Let's get a. Uh, <laughs> let's get a magic formula. I don't think they do Korean magic formulas. That tip card is beautiful. Says Black Dragon. I agree. That was a great looking tip card, wasn't it? Uh, okay. Okay. Here we go. So Cloudian um, Acid Cloud. I think this is Acid Cloud. Cloudium smoke ball. Only goes from silver tip packs. Interesting, Dr. Chickens. Interesting. So that means, for example, this silver tip gladiator's assault means that you can get a, uh, a ghost rare 
I didn't know that, man. I'm learning something new. Thank you, Dr. Chickens. So, is this the silver tip pack? No, this is the... We've opened some Phantom Darkness Korea stuff before. Um, but let's see if we can get something else. I meant um, Ernie Hudson last two years and Salt City Comic Con 2019. Did you meet famous celebrity at all? Says Nathan, I didn't. Ooh, Dark Arm Dragon. I didn't meet... I was going to meet the voice actor of Pegasus and the voice actor of Mai. Um, but unfortunately, I didn't get my, um, my Comic Con wristband in time. Because I was, I, just, I lived quite far away from where it was, and it was, I was impossible. It was impossible for me to get there on time, and I, I missed it. Um, it was really, really, really sucked. Otherwise, I would have been able to go and meet them and get something signed. This was before the, you know, the whole crisis in the world. You know, when you could actually meet people face to face. <laughs> um, five Ds have all chances for ghost rares. Let's go. This is where I'm at. So five Ds, guys. The twelve sets from Five Ds. Extreme victory. Um, Storm of Ragnarok, um, this is the beautiful Star Trek Glass, Duelist Rev, uh, Shining Darkness, um, Absolute Power Force, Stardust Overdrive, Ancient Prophecy, Raging Battle, Crimson Crisis, Crosses of Chaos, and Duelist Genesis. So let's go Duelist Genesis. This is a beautiful looking pack. This is actually really beautiful. Should I try and keep it in uh, good condition? I don't know. I don't think these packs open very easily, that's the issue. Imagine if we got a ghost Stardust Dragon, that would just be insane. Yes! Gotta get them to subscribe to the casual crew, imagine. <laughs> Alright guys, come on. Let's see if we can get something out here. See, opening the packs this way is tricky because I don't want to damage them. Yeah, these ain't coming out, man. Yeah, these are not coming out for some reason. Yeah, this is, yeah these, these packs are really hard to, uh, to open. Aha! There we go. Turbo Booster. Uh, lightsaber, Light Swan Saber, maybe. <sighs> Just a Kinka Bio. Mm. 50 people in the stream, guys. Let's get a Ghost Rare Black Rose Dragon. That'd be cool. I'm going to open these from the bottom up. Okay, we've got a Zexel insert. That's pretty cool. Yu-Gi-Oh Zexel. Please, please tell me you've got humor on the back. Damn, it doesn't have humor on the back. But it's still cool. Just made me do a Korean 5Ds pack. They look really nice. Just me? Is it just me or do the Korean packs look really nice? They do look really nice. Oh, that card is. Some sort of glasses. Um, come on. Let's get a uh, Crimson Crisis get something from the Crimson Crisis, my favourite ghost rare is the Red Dragon Archfiend Assault Mode. Another Zexal tip card. Okay, Blackwing, Bore of the Spear. What's this, Unitoad? I think this is Unitoad, right? Something Toad? Is it Unitoad? I don't know. I think we need to put the hat back on, guys. We're losing the luck. Let's put the, let's put the casual hat back on for some good luck. Um, Raging Battle up next. Great set. Thumb up behind the circle at the pop, then you should be able to pull the middle down. Thumb behind the circle at the top. Zexal and a 5Ds pack, what? Yeah, we had 5Ds in a, um, in a GX pack as well. Very strange. Another Zexal thing. So many Zexals. Kinka Bayou was worth your, your tear. <laughs> I suppose. Regenerating Rose. Another Zexal card thing. Come on, people! Where is the ancient fairy dragon? I want to get a, I want to get an ulti out of these at least out of the five Ds era. Come on, dupe frog. Yeah, it's probably dupe frog. I don't know why I said uni frog because it was wearing out like a hat. <laughs> hat is back. Come on. Uh, I don't know what that card is. X X Saber Ragigura. I remember that one. Okay. Mmm. <laughs> That's uh. That's a uh, lightning unicorn. Come on, people. Stardust Overdrive, the purple set. In fact, in fact, guys, for this live stream, I may as well crack open some more of these Stardust Overdrive. I've got more packs of these, guys. Come on. Ooh, some sort of spider. Interesting. Oh, arachnophobias, look, look away. Circle on the back, 
in a circle on the back. How am I supposed to be opening these? My god, I'm not opening these well at all. Oh yeah, there you go. Hey, that was alright. <laughs> Some sort of Zexal card here. I don't know what that is. But let's see if we can get something. Ah, Cyber Dragon's Vibe. Man, these five of these packs are being tough. We've still got Blackwing. Let's see if we can get something good out of the Blackwing pack. Okay. Alright guys, Dr. Chickens is packed. Okay, so Fairy Archer. <sighs> Fairy Archer. <sighs> something. Card breaker, I think that card's called. Backling, backwing backlash. P Power tool C and D, I think. Ah! We haven't even got a foil, guys, out of these five D's packs. Where are the foils at? So the last four packs is the beautiful uh, coolest revolution. Ah, there you go. That's how you open these packs. Interesting. Okay, this is definitely feeling like a hollow. I'm feeling like a hollow, guys. Amazon is something. Howl of the Wild. Oh, it's a rare. Revived Summon Skull with Dark Ruler Hades on it. Oh, that's tough. Did the extra card I sent make it there safe as well, Noah? The extra card, you say? Interesting. I think there might have been an extra card. I'm not sure which one it was because there was other loose cards as well which I was sent over from my same guy, so what was the card itself? Ah, here we go, another Yusei insert. Nice, that's epic. I love this insert. Is that different to the other one? No, it's the same one. It's the same insert. Beautiful insert. I love these inserts. Okay, come on Star Strike Blast. A Korean Star Strike Blast! Man, this is tough. It has a different back at least, it's pretty cool. <sighs> okay, two more packs. Storm of Ragnarok. Let's see if we can get something out of Storm of Ragnarok. Storm. Oh, that little circle thing on the back definitely helps. A great tip from Matthew. Alright, some old dude. Odin's Eye. Ah, oh, just another rare. Man, we I'm happy that we got an ultimate rare. We got the great Shogun Chen. And we've still got a couple more blisters to open. And I might actually bring in some... That's the giveaway, guys. Drop a like, by the way. Um, and subscribe. I'm just going to cut this one. I can't be bothered to open it nicely anymore. Okay. Extreme victory. Let's see if we can get a ghost rare out of our last pack. Another one of these cards. TG. Oh, just a rare salvage warrior. That's okay, guys. That's absolutely fine. Do not worry, casual crew. We will now be opening a Dark Crisis Blister Pack. I should get the 99.9% uh, the Silver Blue Eyes. I, I should, shouldn't I? Yeah, it's, it's probably a good investment, really. I haven't watched Ruxin's video about the investment, but I don't know. Oh, there you go. Crossroads of Chaos, Horsey Tail. That's a good comment. Spirit of Miss Gel. Hopefully we don't take the L. Hopefully we don't take the L. Card Trooper and Performer Pal Handstand Cocoon. So our pack's down. Put down our foils there. Guys, I'm going to be showing you some cards that I'm selling as well, such as this beautiful Wing Karibo. Nobody wants this, car this card. Are you, like, seriously? I might just keep it, because I'm not even sure I want to sell it. This is beautiful. I'll show you in a minute after we've opened this pack. And after we've opened the Pharaoh Servant as well, I'll be sharing some cards. The epicness continues, Dr. Chickens. Thanks once again, guys. Go check out Dr. Chicken's channel. He is a crazy dude opening crazy cool Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. He's awesome. Dark Scorpion Mina, the Thorn. Agido, Shinato's Ark, Archfiend's Oath, and Skill Drain. Nice. That's the best rare. I will take a Skill Drain. I will, in fact, sleeve up a Skill Drain because I think it's like a 5 to $6 card. We'll take uh, skill drain all day long. Okay, I'll, I'll move the PSA cards down to here so I can show you those later. Down to our last legacy pack. So if you've just come here for the legacy openings, guys, this is the last pack that we're going to be opening. But I might grab some 
packs, but I might save them. I might save them for another video. I'll get them out. I don't know if I want to open them or if I want to sell them, guys. Let me just go into the casual vault and look out for some fresh products. Mr. Joey Wheeler, what do we have in the casual crew today? The casual vault. The casual Yugi cave. What do we have? Joey? I got some 5Ds. I got some Anetta Kiza. I think she uses the Black Rose Dragon. The girl with the red hair. Not Serenity. Alright, guys. So, got some uh, some 5D stuff. When I, when I said Stardust Overdrive, I meant Stardust Overdrive, guys. <laughs> Giving it large with the Stardust Overdrive. Ugh! Okay. Quite a big fat stack of purple. Um... Skill Drain is worth more than most of the hollows in the set, says Warrior. Absolutely. 8.5 is cool. 8.5 is cool. It's a nice card. And then we've got some Crossroads of Chaos with a £5 sticker on it. Lol. <laughs> Alright, so I might open a couple of these later. I'm not sure. Depending on my mood. Depending on the mood of casual Yugi stuff and whatever Joey Wheel is saying. Alright, so last pack is Ferris Servant. Can we get a Jinzo? As those cars just fall out completely. So we've got a um, Artifacts Lancia and a Spell Canceller. That's from Duelist uh, DUD. Pretty good. Pretty good. Ultra Rares. Should I open all 10 display cases to go from the past? I just got them for 40 each. Yes, you definitely should. Jack's Knight. Uh, in preparation for the uh, King's Court next set coming out, which I will definitely see if I can get my hands on. To open for you guys. Crazy seeing price tags on packs, Matthew. Make another video with some 5Ds English ones. Yeah, I think I will do another video, guys. But let's see if we can get something good out of here. World suppression. Souls of the Forgotten. Nope, just a Thousand Eyes Idol to go with our Restrict. That's pretty cool. Guys, I'm not going to complain. We've got Thousand Eyes Restrict. That was epic. Um, but let me show you some of these PSA cards that I am selling. Or looking to sell, such as this Wink Karibo. It's an 8.5 grade. Very, very strange. I think it might be the 8.5 that nobody wants to... But this card shouldn't be an 8.5, guys. This card deserves higher than an 8.5. Take a little look at it. In fact, I will zoom in on it. So it does have a nick here. It's pretty much the only damage that it has. That little nick here. Essentially, that's all that's wrong with this card. There's like no damage on it at all. The foiling looks incredible. On this European card. So just DM me on Instagram if you want Win Karibo. And also got Win Karibo level 10. As an 8. So trying to trying to get these sold now to fund some other things for the channel. So yeah, if you did want the pair of them, I'll of course do a better price. Yeah, this has a bit of whitening down here in this corner. And a bit up top. But all in all, this card is stunning. Absolutely love Win Karibo. And we crew by level 10, so those are the pair for sale. I've got some other random cards that I'm selling, such as this Volcanic Rocket, PSA 8. Just a nice secret rare, really. Volcanic Rocket. I had a ding here. That was definitely not there when I sent it in. I think PSA damaged this card. I might crack this card, actually. That ding there is killer, isn't it? Just looking at it. It's, yeah, it's very bad. That ding right there, guys. Terrible. Who needs five D's packs for the ultis? Yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably do another video where I open these guys. Um, these beautiful European Stardust Overdrive. I might even sell them if you want them. Hit me up on Instagram or my casual crew members. Uh, hit me up. I'm giving I'm giving away. I'm, I'm selling these beautiful Japanese ultis as well. Um, these are Mr. Joey Wheeler's. And this one's mine. So Honest is mine. And these are the heroes. They're all PSA 10. Which is beautiful. So let me know if you'd be interested in those. Uh, finally, got a couple more of my own Earthbound Immortal cards. So I'm selling this Earthbound Immortal PSA 9 ulti. Earthbound Immortal PSA 8 ulti, first edition. 8.5 Earthbound Immortal Cockapakapu. And if you can't afford the 8.5, I've got the 7, which is literally like a $60, $70 card. So yeah, those are the Earthbounds I'm selling. You want to start a little left the Immortal graded collection? 
Does it affect the grading, uh, Matthew, the little dimples? I think it does. I pulled this pack fresh on the channel, Thor. I don't know how this got an eight, man. Is it just the centering on the back? It's probably the centering on the back, isn't it? Centering's very bad. Look at that. It's almost like a misprint. Thor PSA 8. I think it's like, I'm giving, I'm selling this for like $80, $75. This is a nice card I'm selling, Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon, Pop 16. So if you're a Red Eyes fan, hit me up. I'm selling that for $350 or $300. And then we've got an Honest PSA 6. Honest, which I'm selling, which is a ghost rare. I think this one's like $350. So yeah, those are the cards that I am selling, guys. If you want them hit me up or if you want to make me an offer on anything hit me up on instagram i'll probably open up these other cards another time these other packs another time um for another video because it has been a really successful video let's just go over our pools we got an ultimate rare today we've got the great shogun shen the desert twister elemental hero neos gear free the iron knight thousand eyes idol mudora Thousand Eyes Restrict and Skill Drain were the most expensive pools today. And the giveaway for the video is Perfect Machine King. So Perfect Machine King is the giveaway. Just leave a like, comment and subscribe, my casual crew. That was so much fun. I miss streaming. Um, this is the first video I've released all week. But there will be the four and a half thousand subscriber special. Which we're literally with three subscribers away. So if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed... Get us to four and a half thousand. Just hit the subscribe button. We'll be opening this. Um, let me just zoom out. 24 pack of uh, LOB. And then we'll also be opening the Toon Chaos booster box for my casual crews. Uh, my members. And hopefully we get something good. I want to get a collector's rare out of the first edition Toon Chaos. Which are really, really expensive and hard to find. And also LOB. So yeah. Keep it casual, guys. Thank you for watching and coming. If you wanted to pick up any packs or just hit me up about anything, let me know. I've also got these Lighter Destruction thingies for sale. If you wanted to buy one of these, I've had these for such a long time. If you want to pull the Ghost Rare Honest, they look quite good together, I think. The Ghost Rare Honest. Honest is such a hard Ghost Rare, you can hardly see it. You can really hardly see it. But Honest, let me know. But keep it casual, everybody. Thank you so much again, Mr. Dr. Chickens. I appreciate it. You sending us some epic stuff and uh remember the giveaway perfect machine king you got to leave a comment guys liking the videos not enough leave a comment as soon as we finish and keep it casual guys i will see you all in the next upcoming videos on the channel like i say this weekend we'll be streaming again um but yeah see you later guys peace ciao was epic guys that was really good that was great fun hit me up if you want to pick up any of those psa graded cards i am of course open to your offers everyone so send me offers keep it casual see you later